Welcome to another daily recap for Thursday, November 30, 2023. You are looking at a one minute chart of the spiders or the SPY and the single horizontal line at the top of your screen is one of seven levels in the spiders that was identified and put on the chart before the market opened this morning. There are levels calculated every morning in the spiders and they are the basis for activating market orders in the E-mini futures. Today, only one level was hit and it did not produce a trade in the E-minis because of the time of day. I do not allow trades to be activated after 3.30 p.m. If a trade is entered before that time and still active after 3.30 p.m. and neither base hit, profit, target, objective has been hit or a fumble has occurred, then there is a rule that needs to be followed, but that's another lesson for another day. In the case of this 456.74 level, it would have worked as designed because the for a very quick short trade because the spiders came up until it bounced through or spiked through by mere pennies before they pulled away quickly and it would have scored a solid base hit, but the rules are the rules. There are more times than not when a trade taken near the end of the day would leave you hanging and you would end up taking a loss before the market closes. So I choose to trade during the day, especially during the first couple hours of the trading day. That's when your probabilities are the highest that these levels will work, will work as designed. So nothing really more to see here. So let's take a quick look at the tracking log so I can point out something of interest. Again, no trades today, so flat on the day. But notice this. You may have noticed if, you, if you've been watching these daily recap videos that the total days and the total trade days, these numbers have been increasing. And that's because behind the scenes, there is more data being added to this tracking log. And soon there will be over two years of data behind these metrics. So that would further refine the daily averages that you see here and the other metrics you see, like the overall profit and loss percentages. This profit and loss looks at whether the day ends in the green, profit of course, or in the red. And this is just a good visual confirmation of how, how the law of averages works in your favor over time using these daily levels in the spiders to trade in the e-mini futures. I hope you found this information interesting and helpful. Have a great day.